Look at this. Look at this. This is funny. Look at this. Grand Mornier. <laughs> I know. Grand. Grand home furnishings, yeah. I'm not going back. Kill you one day when you're 98. When you're 98, you'll swig it and be like, yeah, yeah. Oh, now I'm gonna die. And take a shit all over yourself, roll around in it, and be like, yeah, GG Allen, fuck you. I think he made it to heaven. I got a feeling from God one day he made it to heaven. You wouldn't think by looking. Many people wouldn't think he made it to heaven by looking at him, but I think he made it there. I got a good feeling from God in Texas. Of all places, I don't know. Maybe they're, like, they, they're probably aware of him, too. Who gives a shit? Maybe I'll get really punk rock and weird. I might start getting tattoos on my fucking neck and body, entire body, and like just grow my hair long as fuck and make it red and blue and pink. Tattoo my fucking uh, I don't know what. I don't want any tattoos. I don't care. But I may make my hair different colors and dress really weird. I don't need any tattoos. I don't care about them in particular. But when I was a kid, I dressed a little different than sometimes I dressed normal. So it makes me feel good. It reminds me of being a kid. <clears throat> Can't keep a good man down. Grand Marnier. Grand. Isn't that stupid? It's like, if it was called Millionaire or something, it would be at least kind of cool. Grand Marnier. Shit, man. Don't kill me with it. You know, after you've been working 55 years and you're 46 years old, you don't want to be a grand in there. Grand air. Grander, hopefully. I don't want to complain about it too much. Maybe I have more money than that. I don't know. God told me I have a million dollars. God told me I have a million dollars. I'm already a millionaire. I don't know how. Because I kept 60% value in something. I don't know. So... Right now, I have $7,000. I have $7,000. <laughs> so it's grand Marnier. But God let me know I'm a millionaire, really from God. I don't see how. I hope it doesn't mean my mom and dad are going to die. Or I don't know what. I 
think maybe I might have that much if, I, if they sell my house, but I don't know. I have no idea how it would be that it would be millions, unless they sell it for three million as a work of art, original work of art. Because there's no house like it. There's no house like it. It's sad how much work they did to bit, how much work they had to do and love they put into um, doing God's work to build the place. It's not like a regular home. I spent, and I don't know what. I worked on it as hard as they did. The people who originally built the home. It was not easy. Grand Marnie felt like shit. Good old Grand Marnie man. Sweet, good sweet whiskey. I hadn't had hard liquor since about 2017. So, they had it at the Hotel Roosevelt. So, I got some of it. I got some different ones. Yeah, piss lord. Yeah, piss lord. Yeah, piss. Oh, no. No, 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 no. No, no. <laughs> Get away from me. Make sure you drink plenty of water so it doesn't smell bad if you do piss. Hey, I'll show you what liquor I, liquor I have. I have this one. Oh, calm truck. Oh, old chum. Would you like this one, old chum? Contro. <laughs> <laughs> Eighteen forty nine, old chum Contro. Oh, sport? <laughs> no, I'd die if I said, if I was literally serious about living old sport. That guy like stole his money or something. Where's the other liquor? Liquor. I don't want to say it. It's a little kid did growing up. None of them were racist, but one of them in South Carolina was, and he ended up having to get hydraulics on his car anyway. So. And his favorite band was like Two Live Crew or stuff like that. Kahlua. This one I think is good. This is a good drink. He drinks a whiskey drink. Ratu's dick. Whiskey dick. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I do Oh, chum, good old control, right? I don't know what that means. Old friend. That was he actually is my friend. Piss, Lord. Yeah, piss. Ugh. Piss is disgusting if it smells too strong when you, people use the bathroom and it's gross. But it's funny. It sounds like Sounds like punk rock or something. It sounds like punk rock. Piss. But not literally. Not literally to piss on things. Good old piss. Smells like it now. Yeah, piss. G.G. Allen covered in piss and blood. They made little cuts on him. Yeah. Fuck y'all. Shit. No, that sounds awful as shit. It sounds like crap. It sounds good. Oh, there's my friend singing a song. 
I wouldn't do, I wouldn't be like Gigi Allen. I'm not a false idol. I wouldn't want to be just like him. I, I'm not like this fucking, oh, sorry. I guess I would be like a false idol if I said that. I'm not like these people who act like a false idol. Like they make their face look exactly like some famous person. That's some bad shit. Like why don't they just be themselves? Like look at Polly Shore. He looks like himself. He doesn't try to look as hard as he can. He doesn't. He doesn't try. To, <laughs> he doesn't try to look like some other famous person or something. Why do people do that? It's a false idol kind of thing. I, you're not supposed to do it. You know, it's it's kind of bad, but movies are good. God made me a, a film editor. God made me a film editor. God made me a film editor and an actor. I guess an actor too. So, or somebody who's in front of camera. Somebody who's in front of camera to preach the gospel of Jesus Christ. But all I did was say, peace, Lord. Ugh, it's gross. It got me around. I'm going to have to brush my teeth for saying it. Ugh. Maybe I have to brush my teeth for saying it. Who cares? Drink up the piss. <laughs> I don't want to go out there. Somebody, I think somebody'd be angry. I think somebody'd be angry because it's late at night. Somebody would be angry. I'd rather be punk rock, and then if I get old, it's like, hey, I get to be myself. You know, I can look cool in the way that I want to look. And not just like a standard punk rocker. That's not what I mean by punk rock. Punk rock goes way beyond any of that. It's um, it's being original and true to yourself. The drummer in uh, Merle Allen's band, he knows what punk rock's about. And you know why? He didn't, he's really punk rock. He didn't dress punk rock. He had just a t-shirt and like clothes he felt comfortable in. And some of it was kind of weird or different or in a way that he thought looked cool. And he just wore regular clothes and like, <laughs> if there's some standard he had to live up to, like looking like everyone else, he didn't do it. He just did his own original cool thing that he felt good about, like the way his clothes felt at home. Like when you walk around at home, he just went out in public like that. And he's still alive. He's a drummer for GG out for uh, Merle Allen's band, and 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 punk rock people and rockers and and uh, musicians get to dress however they want to, and nobody ever was mean to Johnny Depp or any of those people for just dressing different. I'm not like Johnny Depp, and you don't act like a false idol to act like him, right? I hope not. I may have. I don't know if I ever acted like a false idol, but if I. I don't know, I better shut up. Let's drink this whiskey. Uh, drink this whiskey, boys. Let's drink this whiskey, boys. I'm not a sports teacher, just drink this whiskey, boys. <laughs> I'm a sports teacher. Come on, sports. You like sports? I'm gonna drink some alcohol, boys. Come on, man. Uh, come back here. You got the, um, I'll tell you where I was from. Uh, back here, we got the special room, boys. You come back here, and we got the racist shit back here. Come back here, and we'll show it to you where it is. <laughs> what they do is they, um, they, uh, they have, <laughs> They had a little room. They brought us boys back in. They even let me go, who's an Italian. They let me back in the racist room. And they showed us all that. They, they opened a special door in the back. I'm not going to say where it is. Motherfuckers will kill you if you say anything against them. Now, don't mess with them. They're, they're good. But they had the blackface uh, uh, jockeys. Those are out in plain day, but when you went in the back room, they had all the 
uh, racist sticker, uh, everything back, all this par all this stuff, a whole room of racist shit. Uh, real bad rebel flag stuff, KKK shit like that. And they, <laughs> and they, they brought us in there. <laughs> They brought us in there one time, like my friends, they, they invited them in there, like, come on, come in. And they let us see it. So, I haven't really gone back there. But, um, it was okay. That was, that was just that one place. I don't even know if it was racist or not. It wasn't even really that racist. It wasn't that bad. <laughs> it wasn't that bad. But they had, like, those jockeys with a black face, and they had, like, like somebody smiling really big with a watermelon in their mouth and other stuff like that and there's some of that in the south I think I thought it was all I thought it wasn't around anymore and then it showed up here and there <laughs> so it's not like the world's perfect they have it probably down in Orange County in California they probably have it down in Orange County and uh, I don't know where else. I don't care. I don't know. Who cares? It's not like they're really bad against black people. They don't hurt any of them in real life. I don't know. I hate it. I hate thinking about it. I hate it. I never want to think about it again. We go to an, an alien planet where e where uh, where God lets us live with the angels. And it's in heaven one day. But for now, it's going to be on earth. After we die, it's going to be on earth. Heaven's going to be on earth. So there won't be any more of that. We don't have to worry about it being bad anymore. Whoever makes it to heaven. And, and before then, it'll be good too. You just don't have to worry about the racist crap. It's not. Who cares? Who cares? See, here's what we do. Gotta go piss again. John has to, oh, John has to go piss. John has to go piss. Hey, it looks strong. Yeah, I'm cool. I just flex this muscle like this from this angle and hold it, trying to flex it the whole time when I'm standing. <laughs> like there's people who go out in public. <laughs> they go, I think you get the idea. They go out in public and they try to like, pose with their arm looking strong the whole time they kind of flex it the whole time and they get home and their arm feels tired from doing it but they're like uh, come on let's work out try to look better where could it work out I don't know why Oh, this is so funny. I'm not even going to say where this was. This is a long time ago in the 90s. There was this kid, and he showed up at a party. And um, he used to be, like, a little bit heavy. And he, like, lost weight and got skinnier. <laughs> uh, and he, um, but he still wasn't, like, really skinny. But he was, like, <laughs> he was, he was, like, in better shape. And then, and, um, and he took a smoke, he took a token of marijuana at the party and stood there and went like this. He went, and he, he smoked. He, he inhaled the, he inhaled the entire marijuana and, and took a long toke of it and he stood up, but he was like standing there. <laughs> and he, he went, he breathed in. He, he breathed in the whole toke. <laughs> He took, he, he took, he, he took, he took in the whole toke of marijuana. He, he breathed in the whole thing and like tried to make his upper body look cool and stood there. And, um, he was into country music and, um, and, and he took a big toke and then his, his legs looked really skinny. <laughs> his legs looked skinny. Like he had these like pants that almost looked like leather pants, like Jim Morrison, but they're jeans or something. 
and um his legs look real skinny he's like standing there looking trying to look as cool as he could he going, And, and it just, I don't know. That's not really what he looked like. But I think it was really funny he did that. <laughs> I did that. Even. <laughs> he did that in front of everybody at the party. He was standing there and we're like, there were a few of us like, around the room at their parents' house or whatever. But um, I may go to a party. I don't know. I don't know. Do you go to parties? I haven't been to one. I haven't, wanted, I haven't been to a party for grown-ups. Uh, eight years. More than eight years. Since 2015. <clears throat> So, I'm, I've been to, I haven't been much of it anywhere out in public. Maybe, you know, I'd go out now, but I drink, so I'm not going to go out now. Especially since I filmed it and showed all of you, and I'm tired. stupid as shit to make my dad feel good about joking about this. I didn't try to I, I couldn't like look cool like I was in good shape or something. It felt wrong. point was to do that pretend smoking weed. I didn't smoke any weed in here. But I don't know if I'll try it or I probably won't. I can smell it. Somebody else is doing it in the other room in the other apartment. It's weed. Somebody's smoking weed in the other apartment. I had to use a bathroom. I don't smoke weed. <sighs> this is an okay apartment place. It's 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 near Beverly Hills. It's actually near Beverly Hills. It's right near Beverly Hills. It's near a pretty good neighborhood. It's near a pretty good neighborhood. It's in a good neighborhood. It's in a good neighborhood. They have an exotic car place right down the street. <sighs> Why rent it when you could uh, actually get to one day own one unless that's unless that's wrong and bad, then don't even own a car like I had to. I better not show myself. I gotta use the bathroom. <laughs> Punk rock's not really about just the music. I just felt like saying that because I was tired of everything. I thought maybe I could do something cool, like look different.
baby got scared, saw the light. But I'm scared, cause I saw the other side. I saw Jesus Christ on the other side. But I'm scared, cause I saw the other side. Cause I saw Jesus Christ on the other side. But I'm not ready to go to the saw the light. I was eating the cheese dog and chili fries. And it all went dark and I closed my eyes. I started walking down and talking to the line. So Danzig's going to the other side. I got a feeling in my chest and body and bones And I'm too to love you, you was my home Feel that love I can't describe That's it's going to the other side Jerry Contrail. <laughs> this is Jerry Contrail. What does Jerry Contrail mean? <laughs> I don't know what Jerry Contrail means. Jerry Contrail. Jerry Contrail. Jerry Con Contrail. I don't know. Jerry Contrail. Hey. I'm going to go outside. I think. Yeah. Let's go out for a walk. Let's let's walk down the street. Oh, it's a, oh shit! Let's walk down the street. Jerry Collin Trail. I didn't come out sounding like that. I was trying to say it a different way. I didn't think it would come out like that at all.
everything to everybody. You call me trail son. It don't happen that way unless you died on the turntables. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> no. No. Unless you was a wigger on the turntables who died from coal trails. That would be me. That would be a me. Wigger who got so much anxiety. I thought I died on the turntables from contrails that someone, some illegal person accidentally gave me because I wouldn't do any drugs. I don't do any drugs. If that'd be somebody else then. I don't do drugs. Drugs. I don't do any of them. Let's go do this in Hollywood and uh, as they call Los Angeles. Let's go out there and do this. <laughs> Maybe I'll get my friend Chris over to come here. And hopefully Javin too, he can shoot guns if I get like a place that I can actually have like a yard where there's enough like acres here. He didn't shoot guns at my house. In Virginia he shoots guns and I just I, I didn't have guns we didn't have guns or family well my dad and sister did because they were in the army but they didn't have them at home we never had any around us growing up picture of the baby on it. I like to turn the volume up by one. Oh, I like to stop. Here's the baby on the Here's my daughter on my shirt. She's good. She's pretty good. It's a miracle. <laughs> when you're married, it's not bad to be with a woman and make a baby. Make a baby. Well, that's how you get married to somebody. In the Bible, as you try to make a baby with them, and that that means you're married. You're in the ceremony. The ceremony doesn't really mean anything. You, that's how God created this. That that's what makes somebody one flesh. And somebody when they try when they make a baby with them. So, somebody may hear the voices through the wall. Even if they broke up with them after a week, they may hear their voices through the wall the rest of their entire life. It's serious business so if you get married, so you gotta make sure you do it right. Uh, I don't know. I don't know crap about it. I'm stupid. God does all the things that are normal and good, and the devil does all the bad, creepy ass things. The devil did that weird ass creep ass thing. Let's go. But God did that. But the devil did the bad creepy ass one. That made it like as if there was like some person in the other room. Woman. To wipe off my mouth with a paper towel. Cause they're probably trying to think you didn't even have sex, get married. Something like that. It was like, who knows? Probably a regular guy. This is a good neighborhood, but it's, you know. I'm looking 
for my um we're gonna go out to LA. I think yeah. We're going out to LA. Where's my yeah. I'm just gonna put my jeans on. Feel like Tom Minor dying a gay man. He doesn't say that. My friend from South Carolina, Chad. He don't taunt his own backside. If they ever got near him, he'd shoot him in the. <laughs> no. no. But gay, I'm not against gay people. I don't have any. rice, but I'm not going to. I have a bunch of all that made me want to get back home. For now, let's just, just go out there and see if we find anyone. Maybe I can get an Uber. Let's get an Uber somewhere. I'm going to get an Uber somewhere. No, that's crazy. Let's just walk out of there. I was gonna get an Uber. Until a pango kiambo ho di. No, no, hey. Good old Mrs. J. <laughs> Mrs. J. Kill. Go on, Miss J. Kill and piss, Lord. Yeah. There, no, no. No, Mrs. J. Kill and her husband. She's married to a young guy who's like her. I look young sometimes. Well, if I lose weight. I don't know. Sometimes I look young. I don't know. It's like a trick of being skinny. And it's not a trick. You know, at my age, it would be a trick of being skinny to look like I was really young. Unless I was young, if, unless I become young looking when I'm 55. Maybe I'll be young looking when I'm 55. God does it all. There's no tricks about it. <sighs> it's funny. Because people think that, like, they, like, stare at themselves in the mirror and they think they look so cool and stuff. And they, like, think that, like, they're so amazing and great and everything. But God just made them that way. Hi, Mrs. J. Kill. Mrs.? Yeah, <coughs> Mrs. Looking for my, oh, my phone's right there. I'm filming on it. Fix my shoe. Let's just go out there. Very tall trail. Very tall trail. What does that mean? Con trail. It means. I have no idea. Uh, the person who owns this building party would be a con trail. Wrong idea, man. He doesn't want to party with the people in here. It'd be creepy. That's, that's not right. It's just not right. Unless it, unless it changes one, unless it changes in the future. 
Hey, God, I'm drinking water. I'm just drinking the sink water. It tastes pretty good in LA. Thank God we have fresh, clean water supply in America. It tasted better to me than the bottled waters. First drink of a bottle of water I had, it tasted like soap. The sink water tasted better because I had this beautiful, good well. I had this really good mountain water from a mountain. So maybe some of the bottled water is maybe you know you can get fine mountain water from anywhere that you like the best mountain. But my favorite mountain was where I had the water I'm gonna get. I thought it was the best for me on earth ever. But I don't know. And my AW cream soda cream stuff blowing my nose, I'm gonna go. Let's see, where are we going to go? Oh, shit. Our vampire is coming from there. I thought a vampire would be up there. And then that sound came out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, This out. Look at that. He don't pound tail cone to home cow cone. Hello? Somebody parked their scooter right there. Don't say it. Somebody might call him trail. Hmm. Yeah. Had that dubbed to the room.
Decals. <laughs> no, jackass. Decals. No, don't say that. The rainbow they show me. Hey, it's a barbershop pole. A barbershop pole. A barbershop pole. Hey, for a dog. Eloise's. Show it. You're gonna look up where I live. I don't care. I'll be leaving somewhere else. What would you do? Break in the gated entry? <laughs> Somebody else might be. That looks like a good door. Looks pretty good. Jerry Contra. <laughs> Jerry Contra. Hello? Hello? I'm not supposed to know how much money I have because it's not because my mom and dad made it that way. It's because uh, the people I know in my life, well, it's because of God. God didn't want me to set a net worth. God didn't want me to set a net worth. Hey, Ridley Scott. Hey, Joaquin Phoenix. Oh, it's there again. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe it's okay. Maybe it's better. Maybe it's huger than I thought. Okay, hopefully nobody comes out of a dark alley. Who knows what's going to come out from back around that corner. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, man. That's scary.
sweet pool table. What's the matter with me? <laughs> no. Oh, shit, that's scary. Kill her. There's this kid named Killer I knew growing up. I don't want to think about him anymore. He was cool. He graffitied my mar my vintage Marshall 77 amp. <laughs> but he was cool. Now it has art on it. It's just the way it looks. God made it that way for some reason. He's a... It's on the side of that Marshall here. Hey, this looks cool. Hey, this looks cool. Hey, yeah. At the car wash. Baby, baby, did 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 did. No, get away from me. Do no no do do do. No. Hey, Jerry Seinfeld. <laughs> Jerry Seinfeld, the richest one. He knows there's nothing bad here. He knows there's nothing bad in, Ho in Hollywood and uh, Los Angeles. <clears throat> he sees you. He sees you. <laughs> Jerry Seinfeld sees you. You know what he's thinking? I don't know. Look at this. Ah, taking a crap on the potty, a poo coming out of a butt. coming out of the butt. I didn't ever show that. I John Waters did. But he didn't show it actually coming out. <laughs> he didn't actually show a poo coming out of the butt, but he showed poo in a butt. Somebody may take a poo in a bar down there with it. <laughs> Somebody, oh, no.
Hey, look, on the side of the road in Los Angeles, a bale of hay. On the side of the, on the, side of the road in Los Angeles, a bale of hay and cactus. figure out who's going to look it up and see where I live where I don't live I live in Roanoke but I don't live there anymore I don't know where I live so at least I got to walk I get to walk I'm gonna go. Well, I'll stay. I'll go back in my hotel, my apartment, Airbnb. Hey. I'm sitting around. Not literally.
Peyton, 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 back off, man. <laughs> no, back off, man. Oh, do do, come, come, Peyton. Don't listen to him. Don't listen to him. It's a bad idea. Smooth swig of whiskey. Oh, don't give a shit, man. Sweet swig of oh, whiskey. <laughs> What shall I do? What shall I do? <laughs> what shall I do? What shall I do?
What shall I do? Sean Prouder, why don't you? <laughs> That's for me. Sean Prouder, why don't you? A robot, you be like this. A square, that's you. That's what they do to me. It's be like, yo. <laughs> you just man. It is tall. It's like this. Skinny waist. Be strong, good looking face. Let's go film him on Venice Beach. Be strong. He bought it. No. He don't fuck with that. See? He don't. Do you think that I don't? I don't I don't I don't I don't I don't I don't He looks good. His face looks like a model. He's very good looking like this. But no, <laughs> no, 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 he's not, he's not, he ain't old yet, and one day he'll be old and look like this, oh, <laughs> when he's very old, uh, not at all, man, when he's like 85, maybe. Maybe when he's 93, because he works out, but he's like really tall. And to see that would be like a fag up my own ass, like this, going into my own ass, my dome, like this. Here we go. Bye. <laughs> praise God. Praise Jesus. Bye. Praise God. Praise Jesus. Bye.